Hello, and how are you guys doing? Today, I'm going to show you how to create an alias region. So before we talk about alias regions, let's talk about duplicating tracks. So the reason why we would duplicate a track is to thicken up the texture. So the easiest way to do this is to just copy and paste, or you can just do click, option, drag. And then you can just drag that MIDI region you want into a new instrument. So now let's say you want to edit some pitches in that first MIDI track. So that also means you have to manually go back to every track you copy to to make sure they are all correct, which is very tedious. So the way we get around that is by creating what we call alias regions. So that basically means it just mimics our original MIDI regions. So that way we don't have to just create a copy and paste of the MIDI region we want. So the way we do that is by holding shift option, click, and then drag. And once you do that, you can see I can edit any pitch on that first track and the alias region will just automatically mimic it which is a huge time saver. So here's a bonus tip. So with that alias region, you can go to inspector and you can transpose it up an octave and thicken up the texture even more or differently. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next week.